So I wanna paint this cross section here of the castle and I like uh, the challenge of the perspective, trying to get the perspective lines with this road leading in here. So I think this is the scene we're gonna try and capture. Today I'm painting on Arches oil painting paper. Uh, so this requires no priming and it's in a, uh, a pad of paper. I'm gonna list my colors on my palette down below in the description. So check that out and let's get started. I really enjoyed painting on this uh, oil paper. It was really nice to not have to prime anything and the paint went on really nicely. I'll leave a link down below if you'd like to buy some and try it out for yourself. So what's the worst mistake that you've made halfway through a painting? Leave a comment down below and how did you face it? Hopefully we can all learn from each other's mistakes. I'm relatively happy with how things are shaping up, but I can see that I've actually kind of messed up the perspective. So what do you do when you find yourself in a position like this? The, the, the thing that we're gonna need to do is to go back and fix some of the perspective lines. One of the things that I can see is that the uh, perspective line that's kind of down, going down here is at a steeper grade than some of these lines that are up here, and that should be flipped. These lines need to be more angled downward because they're higher up from the, van from the horizon line. And I kind of had my horizon line right around in here. And so I can actually see that uh, my horizon line is even tilted a little bit. And just through the process of painting, things have gotten off a little bit off kilter. So that's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna go ahead and kind of fix up and shore up these lines to get the perspective a little bit better than what I had had. I was really initially discouraged with how the perspective got off on this painting because I worked so hard to try to make the perspective right at the beginning. Obviously that's the answer, but you know as well as I do that things don't always go according to plan. The good news is, is that I didn't give up, I kept painting, and that's what I wanna suggest for you. If you've ever felt stuck, or you're not happy with how the painting is turning out, you're not sure what to do, remember this isn't a failure on your part. This is an opportunity, an opportunity for you to solve a new problem, to go out, to learn something. Maybe you need to get a book from the library, watch a YouTube tutorial, but look at these instances when mistakes happen, when disasters happen, that these are learning opportunities because that's how we grow as artists. We grow through experience. And if we didn't have these mistakes, we wouldn't have the experience. And so everything that you do is just one more step towards mastery and becoming the artist that you wanna be. In the end, I didn't give up, I made some adjustments and I'm happy with how this painting turned out. Remember guys, you have a voice that matters. Go be creative, don't give up, and I'll see you next time.